Hi everyone, welcome to Back to Dragon Image. Today I'm here to show you something that isn't particularly new, but we've got a new version of it in. Um, this one here is a S-type focus uh, adjuster. So basically what it allows you to do, it allows you to put gobos in front of the flash head or any other continuous light that takes a Bowens fitting like a Aperture 300D or a Aperture 120D or a Light Pro uh, 2000 or 1000 Shark, um, allowing you to take that light and then focus it through a lens. Um, you can also put in these gobos, you can put in uh, other slides and stuff like that if you want colored backgrounds. Um, having the ability now to change over lenses means that you can get a more focused look or using a longer lens gives you a, more of a throw, uh, whereas using a wider lens gives you more of a spread. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're going to put it on one of the Light Pro 1000 watt kind of LED lights, just so we can kind of see the examples of what kind of results you get out of them. Okay, so we've mounted it here on our 1000L from Lipro. Um, this is a continuous LED, uh, just so we can kind of see it in action, but you could use a, a flash head, such as a Godox or a Bowens or uh, the Flash Pro uh, flash heads that take a S-type fitting um, and use it for photography. But in this particular case, we wanted to put it on a continuous light so you can actually see it live as we're kind of doing it. Um, the kit comes with a variety of slides. These are different kind of pictures and I'll show them up on the screen now so you can kind of have a look at the variety of those particular slides. Um, you can also get your own slides made or you can make your own using acetone. You can print something out and, and cut it out the size, allowing you to get some more creative kind of solutions. Um, the other thing that it comes with are these little things called gobos. Uh, these come in a variety of different types and you can get them made again, you can get them made custom, uh, not by us but by Roscoe's and you can get, and Roscoe's sell a huge collection of them, um, different type of window sizes, etc, etc. Um, and what they do is they restrict the amount of light that's going through and gives you a much crisper edge. So you can see now we've got this like flood of light that it's kind of producing, whereas now I can really just go and make a nice crisp circle. Um, you can kind of see that there, giving me more like that traditional kind of spy movie spotlight effect, um, which is quite handy if you want to do like a puppet show and stuff like that, where you can create things using shadows and so forth. Um, it also helps being able to throw light into a particular area with, with kind of full control. So you can see there's no light kind of spilling off to the edges to light other items within that scene, but really just where you want the light to be. And I've seen people make little diffusions for them and stuff like that, which helps give you a pool of light um, that's a little bit kind of neater and nicer. Um, as I said, with this one, you do have the ability to take off the lens itself with use a Canon fitting, and you can replace it with other Canon lenses to give you a smaller or larger spread for that focused uh, light source. But keep in mind that you've only got a certain range for focusing, so some lenses at full focus may not give you the results you're after. Uh, and there you have it. So if you're interested in these type of products or anything else, you can visit your local Dragon Image. If you want to see this in action, you can always visit your local Dragon Image and try it out in one of our studios. Thanks.